Hello, hello everybody, and welcome to another adventuring adventure through the Commonwealth Wasteland. Perhaps if more robots possessed by Mercy algorithm, we wouldn't be forced to destroy them. In the life of Jeremy. I hope you are having a wonderful day so far. Mr. Robot is not going to be able to get there. soon enough they will all under be under my control so it is fun you have dampening coil ah yoshu yoshu now to get nuclear fuel I'm ready. The next step seems simple, but do not be deceived. Two hundred years ago, I launched all of Yang Zi's high-yield nuclear missiles, as ordered. For two hundred years, I have lived with that guilt, that shame. So much fire, such bay, but one missile failed to launch. You must go down. Remove the warhead, then bring it to me. Why don't you get it? Ah, because I have different tasks. While you are getting warhead, I will prepare the reactor. But now I must warn you. There is danger. We shall. Old crew, still down there. Not okay like their captain. Worse, they do not harm me, but they will kill you. I, I cannot kill them. Still, they are my crew, my family, Jaren, all of us. But you must do what you must do. I just still have that shish kebab on me, don't I? I do. some rad X too while I'm at it. room. Nice. Oh, that, that's where I need to go. Having any of it. 
psycho jet, please. Town. That's it. Come on. You. I'll go ahead and take them. Why not? Right, I forgot that one of those tools earlier caps like that. So I need to go back. He's hauling ass trying to catch up. the hell is happening to the game. Ooh, what was that? Wait. God damn.
here is the warhead. No difficulty with the warhead, I trust. Not yet. Well, go. Go. Oh. No difficulty with the warhead, I trust. I'm alive, aren't I? Be resolved. And the thing is done. Now, here is what you must do. Head down to the reactor. Take dampening coil and warhead with you. First, insert the dampening coil. Carefully. Xiaoxin. Then, put warhead into the reactor. As you do that, I monitor power levels from the control room. Do not put warhead in first. Do that? Si Wang. Death for you and me both. I don't want to do that just to see what happens, if it'll allow me. No! You fool! Oh, the dampening coil! The reactor will explode! Bao oh, Zhao! Noise detected. Entering safari login. <laughs> That's great. I love that it gives you the option. Captain Zhao. Was not sure my beautiful Yangzi would hold together. But we did it. Here, payment Zhao promised you. Plus, to show my thanks, I give you these uh, uh, transponders. Each one acts as a homing signal for missile I can fire from my Yangzi. Only small, tactical use. But you should still get as far away as possible. Throw transponder. Like a grenade to activate it. Then wait for Bao Zhang. Kaboom. Why would you let me use up your missiles? I have no wish to bring weapons back home. I leave the fire here. And I owe you. Zhao pays his debts. Besides, my missiles just might... Save your bacon. Soon I will set sail. You should get ashore. Farewell, American. I must admit, I have met worse capitalists. Us to know if I can make more or if there's only so many. Let's head back to home real quick. So I can drop off this excess stuff.
You should have seen it. We cut those raiders to pieces. I doubt they'll be back. Who the hell are you guys? Oh, Minutemen. Hello, sir. General. Y'all are still talking to me? Oh, I'm honestly surprised. Robots. Damn. I was hoping to spill a little blood. Strong. Well, I got to get no. Strong. Strong. Go with me. To serve. Yes. Come with me. Strong travel with human. I want to see. Robots hard to find. I really just bash them and dent them until they're done. Um. I want to see if I have any other swords. That. I could take something like that. Well, how much is this way? Three. One. Three's not bad. And what about the shish kebab? Three. Okay. I can hold on to something like that. That's not too bad for a melee. Ooh. Do I have anything on me? No. Cool. Just need a full bottle and some bones to break. Fifty-five and fifteen, twenty-five and thirteen. Still not better. Petrified serrated blade. Fifty-five, fifteen, fifty-five, fifteen. But it ignores thirty percent. We'd move faster if you kept your eyes on the road and off the odds. So I think I'll take that. So I will put that. Oh. Okay. Well. Hold on to that. That means I should go to here. This isn't what I was looking for. That is Saga's Ironworks. Is 
to maybe south of it? Because I thought it was like north of, of the ironworks. It might be south. Since there's an overpass, and I remember it being under an overpass. <sighs> yeah, that has to be it. Sorry. Thought you might be one of those forged maniacs, but you don't have the burns. A group of them took over the old ironworks, and they'll shoot you just as soon as look at you. It takes a lot more than a bunch of punks to scare me. Maybe that's because you ain't got a farm and a family to think about. Even so, those guys are serious. That bastard son of mine, Jake, snuck out in the middle of the night to join him. He grabbed my granddad's old sword. It's the closest thing I've got to an heirloom. I don't guess you'd be crazy enough to try and get it back for me. I've got caps, if that's what you want. Industrial buildings like that are pretty dangerous. I see what you're getting at. 200 caps if you can bring it back for me. He disliked that? I thought that'd be so... Whatever. I already cleared that place out. I've got your sword right here. What? Really? You, uh... Did you... What happened with Jake? He's dead. That's what happens to raiders. God damn. I'd hoped he'd come around when he realized what that life meant, but I... Here's something for your help. Keep the sword. Gotta move on. And it'll just remind us of him. Cool. Well, that's done. Um... Run over here, help defend the checkpoint. Sure he won't like this either, but I honestly don't give a damn. So I what he does ah. like. Anymore. Cool. Didn't seem like it. Checkpoint secure. Area patrol in progress. Situation off over analysis here. finalized. No hostiles detected. Now wear your guns around my neck. Stay gone. 
You have some sort of medical problem here, or are you just yanking my chain? Could use some supplies, actually. You got the caps? <laughs> How's my purified water doing, anyway? 21. Yeah. All right. Well, now that I am able to get rid of it, back to the drive in. Hmm. All right. Let's head back to Nuka World now. They're threatening to tear the place apart if we don't get the hell out of there. It's cute, but irritating. Then I guess we'll just have to let them know who they're dealing with. You did good. Now get going. The adults are gonna discuss this. Figure this would happen sooner or later. Our outposts caught the attention of some of our new neighbors in the Commonwealth. An outside crew of raiders think we're honing in on their territory. Sounds like they're planning to tear the place up, and our people with it. Suppose this provides us a good opportunity to make an example. You thinking what I'm thinking? I will rip them to shreds personally. Bingo. Only language raiders in the Commonwealth understand. Force. But you should probably get going. You wouldn't want to keep our new friends waiting. Wouldn't be neighborly. Of course. But first, into the market. definition of a good day is one where I don't find a nest of blood worms in a utility tunnel. 
I'm not looking for trouble, just just some good deals. Well, well. It's the highest and mightiest himself. How can I be of service, eh? Let's see what you got. You got it, boss. Get rid of that. God damn. Rid of that. Good enough. All right. Or what else was there to do here? What is that? Chicken litter game. Yeah. All right. Let's head down here. Let's try this again. See the spaceship from here, just like he promised. Just sitting in that damn junkyard. So close, so tantalizing. But I digress. Do you have the spacesuits? All five. Here they are. Perfect. Here is your payment. We can proceed with the next step in the plan. I'm counting on you to help us with it. We need to take control of the spaceship in the junkyard. I know it's a lot to ask, so I'm willing to give you one of Hubology's great treasures if we succeed. You do know it's not a real spaceship, right? Your mind is limited. If you had my expanded mental powers, you would see the truth about the spaceship. All right. Together, we can capture that spaceship. I knew I could count on you. Let's go tell the others. Everyone gather. Form the wheel. Form the wheel. The, the time has come. The hub's grand plan can enter its next important phase. All of your hard work has borne fruit. We can liberate the junkyard and take control of what we need. Thanks to our mercenary, we have the spacesuits to protect us from the robot guards. So put on these spacesuits and take up your arms. We have a mercenary to lead us into combat. They may be a bit snug at first, but they'll protect you. All right, let's try this again. Hopefully I don't try to bash one, eyes of, them for one of them in the face again. The hub would be proud of what we are about to do. What? Hmm. Got company! Some watcher! What's that noise?
What just happened? Shoot her front. Why the hell are they not helping with this fucking thing? experienced at fighting than we are. How should we do this? I'll just take cleansed with me. The rest of you... He is our best fighter, so I suppose that makes sense. Good luck. Mm -hmm. was a mole rat, so... right away Stand back. where's this guy that's supposed to be following me right here No! 
one can be strong. He didn't do anything, dude. There she goes. Now she's running. Spoken spoken in the hope to support me. We fought a great battle today. A battle we could not have won without our friend. It came with a steep price, though. We will mourn Tula's passing. May she join us with the Sky Father, but our work is not done yet. Taking the spaceship is not enough. It must be made to fly again. It must be ready to take us to our destiny. Soon, you will earn the greatest reward Herbology has to offer. For now, rest and celebrate. You have earned it. Hi. What a glorious battle. You were magnificent. Too bad about Tula. She died so young before she could fully realize her true potential through Hubology. I promised you a payment. This gun was passed down from the Hub himself. Take great care with it. I need your help for one last thing. I need to get that spaceship powered up again. But we don't have any fusion cores. I have some extra ammo for the hub's gun that I can give you if you succeed. You have to listen to me. The spaceship is just a carnival ride. You can't make it fly. The Star Father has promised me that it will work. It may look like a thing of make-believe, but we will make it work with the Star Father's blessing. So will you at least get the power running? I'll be glad to help. Good. Once you get it powered up, we can work on making it space-worthy.
What happened to the chick that they're all boohooing about? Where and when did she die? Oh, come on. Yes. Why did he dislike that? He's a pain in my ass. Well, get over it, because I'm doing it again. Nice. Come on. Got stuck again. Hey. The lights! It's amazing! You've done it! Into the spaceship, everyone! We need to run a test of the system. Come inside with us and turn it on. You'll see that the hub's prophecy is true. Ultimate UFO! Is 
that because I fucking put one too many fusion cores in it? Oh, you like that, huh? God damn. love to be able to get those fusion cores back out of it though clearly I can't well off to the commonwealth Strong feels strange, like enemies watching. Hmm, they probably are. Hey. Well, look who finally made it. Go fuck we yourself. spotted a pretty shady group nearby. Could get company any minute, so watch your back. Come back up here, center. Or is that just where you're gonna have this conversation, huh? So, are you the nuka world asshole that thought you could waltz your people into my territory? You give me one good reason, I shouldn't slice you open and eat your heart right here. You listen closely. This land is ours. So turn around and crawl back under whatever rock you came from, right now. Whoa, whoa, easy. Take it, take it easy, all right? Sure, just, uh, you know, I'll keep it. This place was a shithole anyway. Strong, I cannot get a read on you.
Huh. Heard some rumbles this one didn't get you either. Figure I shouldn't be surprised. Those raiders won't be causing us any more problems. That's what I've been hearing. So I suppose your recent success brings us to the next step. Loyalty. Without loyalty, everything that's yours ain't. And to keep a crew loyal, you need to keep them happy. Now, keeping raiders happy isn't real hard. Just have to make sure they've got their basic necessities. Just like any other settlement. That they've got some things to keep them entertained. And that their food's taken care of. Which, with raiders, well, isn't like dealing with other settlements. Now, if you want me to go into detail on any of that, you just say. What can you tell me about entertainment for the outpost? Well, it's a damn handy way to keep folks distracted if you're lacking in certain basics. Constructing pick-me-up stations or getting one of your crew working on a booze still will certainly help lift your outpost's <laughs> spirits. And if the place has got a Nuka World transmitter powered up, you can construct amplifiers to help as well. Anything else I can answer for you? Tell me more about providing food for the outpost. So, managing your outpost's food can get a little tricky. No one ever joined a crew to dig in the dirt. So you'll want to make sure you've convinced enough settlements to supply your gang. People at the outpost can farm in a pinch, but they sure as hell won't be happy about it. Now, if you're ever wondering if your outpost has enough food, you should take a look in your Pip-Boy. It ought to have a page that'll show you everything your outpost currently needs, food included. If they're low on grub, it's probably time to get a new settlement supplying you. Or you could always drop some food direct in their workshop if it comes to it. Now, was there something else? I want to know more about managing the outpost's basic necessities. Day-to-day -day needs. They're pretty straightforward. Just need to make sure you've set up solid defenses. Plenty of beds under cover, and enough clean water to go around. Not much more to it than that. Was there anything else? I think I've got everything I need to know. Sure. If you've ever got more questions, you come find me. Or you can always consult that pit boy on your arm. No better tool to tell you what your outpost may be hurting for. Now, depending on the state of the place when you hit it, this first outpost might already have some of the bare bones set up. All you've got to do is build up what's missing. If you want to run some jobs to convince more settlements to start sending supplies, well, you know how this works. You just come talk to me. And I was thinking, with the outpost coming as far as it has, might be time I set up shop there. Save you a trip any time you want to run a job. You just let me know if that's something that'd interest you. Be good to make some trouble in the Commonwealth again. So, there anything I can do? Hmm. Was hoping you could arrange a job for me. You got it. Just need the details. What job you looking to run? I want to claim another outpost for our gangs. Let's just get the first one squared away for now. Expansion can come later. <laughs> I want to convince a new settlement to start coughing up supplies. Well, all right. So which gang do you want keeping? The pack. I'll send word along. Or howl or something. <laughs> so, what's the target? Huh. Was that... Believe that spot's one of yours, boss. Still want to proceed? Yep. That one's the target. Just wanted to make sure. Bunch of ways you can convince these folks to hand over supplies. You can try talking them into it. Tools from the opera. And if none of that works, just...
All right, so let's see here. Workshops. What am I missing? The fence and beds. Off to the slog. Actually, let's head back to the drive in because I want to try to make some more of those persuasion grenades. Or at least figure out how. Is there anything in here? Yeah, that. Thought there was something I was wanting to drop. And that. And that. Fever Blossom. Got it. Yes. Hey, you. Christ. Who gives raiders a damn radio station? What can I do for you? I'm here to make you an offer. This place will supply me and my friends in Nuka World caps, food, whatever you got. In exchange, we won't bother you. Oh, I... I, I don't know. A lot of hard work goes into this place. Can't... Listen, you're going to start working for me now, all right? Just keep the supplies coming and we won't have any problems. I... fine. If it'll get you off my back. Now please, get the hell out of here. Work damn hard to keep this place afloat. And you, Waltzin. You want to fucking talk some hey. more shit? Don't worry, you'll get your cut. Though I can't promise it won't get dropped a couple times during delivery. Thanks for not killing us, I guess. Hey there. How about you buzz off?
Fiends and shadows. <laughs> All right, defenses. Beds. Where are all the beds at? You're gonna have to get the hell out of my fucking way. Let's head back to Nuka World. And I think that is a wonderful place to end it today. So I hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you again next time. We actually got some stuff done this time around. Didn't get distracted by doing anything at the drive-in, which is nice. So let's see if we can keep that going next week. So as usual, as always, until next time, be safe, be kind, and have a good rest of your day. <laughs>